Grandfather Tree, do you hear that? Or just sleep uh, now? I've got bark in my ears, but oh, I do hear something. Wait a minute, somebody's coming on the Zoom. Ho, 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 ho. Oh, it's We're not Merry drink. Christmas, it's but Santa. happy summertime. Hello. <laughs> so excited. Hello, oh, hello. Nice we are to see so you. happy to see you. I'm happy. Well, it's nice to be here. <laughs> you know, Santa, there's so much going on in the world, right? And I just know that it'll just warm all the children's hearts to see you. Even though it's June, it's not even near Christmas, right? Well, we're halfway to Christmas, aren't we? Here we are we at the are. Christmas. But I have yes, to report so to you, I know you have your checklist. I know you're going to check naughty and nice, but let me tell you, the early reports that are coming in, the kids are amazing. They've worked so hard. They've had to Oh, oh, oh yes, I've been learn. watching. I've been watching. They're, they're dealing with the changes in such a powerful way. It's, it's a beautiful thing. That's true. That's right. Yeah, even even the tree can see. The kids are playing in the trees more often. That's wonderful. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> so, you know, Santa, I was thinking, I asked Grandfather Tree earlier in the week if he, because I always go to my elders for knowledge and because you guys have all the best stories and the best knowledge. So I asked Grandfather Tree, well, what is three things that kids could do right now, just from his heart, off the top of his head, Three things that that would make that that would help the kids make the world a better place that they live in, and he came up with some pretty unique things. And I thought we have to ask Santa that. Can you answer oh, 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 that? What yes. are three things that you think kids could do right now to make the world a better place? Yes. Well, you hit it on the head to start with. Right now is the key. Be present to where you are. See the beauty in everything around you remember that beauty in your heart and that beauty in your parents and in your siblings your friends even if you're looking at them on these funny little computer things they're still there and you can have a screen heart where you can connect with people on the screen and slow down a little bit and breathe breathe take it in this moment is all there is take it in take it in breathe and oh, that makes me want to breathe deep right now, just hearing Santa say that. Oh, I love that guy. <laughs> well, thank you, Tree, for giving us the oxygen. We, uh, we count on you to keep giving us oxygen so that we can have these beautiful breaths. That's right. Wait a minute. Is that, is that part of your second thing? Gratitude? Well, you're a sharp one, little fairy, Jenna. <laughs> Yeesh. You know, I almost just wanted to stop in just the right now instead of confusing it with three different things because in the now, you can access all of it. If you just slow down and don't go off into the future and don't go back in the past, just hang out with what is right now. There's so much beauty to be seen and so much gratitude for all that you do have. And being able to say thank you to the people like the tree, we could say thank you for the, to the tree for giving us the air and the beautiful green and, and something to climb on. So, so yes, as part of being present, you will see the beauty and you will want to share your gratitude for the beauty that's all around in your life. Oh, I say thank you to Grandfather Tree every day, don't I? You do, like he said, simple things. Yeah. Yeah, isn't that what, simple, what right? seems to be right. happening? That, that's what's happening here, right? Is that you're being called forth. You're, you have to stay home. You can't go to do all the things you're used to doing. So when you have to stay home, it's inviting you to slow down, inviting you to remember the simple pleasures of life. It's not about the next new thing you can get. It's about the thing that you are already and just being with the beauty of that and being with the beauty of who you are. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, Santa, I knew you were the one that we needed to talk to. And I, I can't wait to, to make sure that all the kids can see this and, and feel everything you're saying. And even just starting with taking that deep breath, I, I'm, I keep getting stuck on the, oh, we're here right uh, now in yes, the moment. You know, 
Do you know you breathe about 20,000 times a day? Something no, is really? breathing. Yes, something is lot. breathing you because usually you don't think about those things, right? It's just automatic. Something is breathing you. That's the magic. That's the magic of Christmas, the magic of life, the magic of being alive is that you are being, you are being breathed right? And at the same time, your heart is being beaten over a hundred thousand times every day. Something is beating your heart. And so there's all this that we take for granted. And when we slow down, we can sense that. We can feel that. Yeah. Oh. Sometimes you could even feel your own heart beating. Yes. Yes. And what is that? What is that magic that is making you be alive? It's you. You are the magic. And and that's what's happening. And that's what Christmas is trying to say all year long, is that you are the magic. You don't have to look for other sources for the magic. You don't even have to go to Santa for the magic, because the Santa magic is inside you already. Oh, 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 but we love you. Forget about it. Happy thoughts. Oh, boy. There yes. <laughs> We don't have to come to Santa, but we sure love coming to Santa. <laughs> yes, I like it too. And I'm always happy to remind you, just like Thank the trees you. are, and just like the fairies, we're always happy to remind you that yeah. you are the magic. You are the magic that you're looking for. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. Santa, I know even during the summer, you're super busy, but I'm grateful for you for being present with us. <laughs> and just to keep it very simple. We love you. Is it okay if we call you again? Because I think the kids would really love to hear from you a little bit more. Of course, I'm always here and I'm always happy. And now with this fancy Zoom of, Zoom of fear, we can just come and talk to each other all the time. And, and you're practically on my lap right here. And you can <laughs> tell me what you want for Christmas. And we can, we can sing and dance and play and have a good time and, and we can remember. <laughs> Because really, oh, it's about wonderful. remembering. Uh, thank you, Santa. We're gonna, we're gonna, I'm gonna blow you a kiss from Grandfather Tree and me. Are you gonna catch it? Oh, yeah. I'm gonna catch it. Here we go. I'm, I'm gonna I'm do it for both of us. That's the kiss. <laughs> whoa, whoa, got them both. Oh, he caught them. He caught both of them. Oh, wow. <laughs> of course. Yay. Now, I'll send one back to you and to all the kids that are watching. Here Yay. we go. A big set. Here we go. Here. Oh, ah! <laughs> that loving kiss knocked me down almost. Yes. So be ready. Remember, always remember to remember. <laughs> the magic is inside of you. That's where we hit it. Oh, <laughs> thank you, Santa. We'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye, Santa. Yes. <laughs>